When you received a photo enforcement complaint by mail, you might have asked, do I need to appear in court? What are my options? What happens if I miss my court date? This video will answer those questions and more. Photo enforcement complaints are issued by mail after a photo enforcement camera takes images of your vehicle. The packet contains several pages, including a photo enforcement Arizona traffic ticket and complaint. Here is the first page of the packet. The complaint is located inside of the packet. Here is an example of a complaint. This is a photo enforcement Arizona traffic ticket and complaint. The charge is listed on the complaint. On the complaint is the date and time of your acknowledgement date. This is the deadline for acknowledging the complaint or being served. To avoid being served and having to pay the service fee, you must do one of the following options by the acknowledgement date listed on the complaint. Plead responsible and pay the fine, listed as option A. Send in the declaration of non-driver if you believe you are not the driver, listed as option B. Request a hearing if you believe you are not responsible, listed as option C. Send in the waiver of service so you will not be served, listed below option C. Sign up for defensive driving school, listed as option D. More information on your options is listed in the packet. If you do not select an option, you must appear in court on your arraignment date. If you are interested in and eligible for defensive driving school, go to the court's defensive driving school webpage for more information. If you send in the waiver of service, you will not be served and will not be charged a service fee. However, you must still choose one of the other options by the date listed in the summons section of the Arizona traffic ticket and complaint. If you do not satisfy this complaint by your court date, the court will enter a default judgment against you and impose a civil sanction, which may result in the suspension of your driver's license and the inability to register your vehicle with the Arizona Motor Vehicle Division. The court may also refer this matter to a collection agency and assess additional monetary fees. If you are a resident of another state, your home state may be notified of the default judgment and take further action. If you miss your court date and your case is in default, you have two options. You can pay your balance in full to remove the default, or you can file a motion with the court. The judge may or may not grant your motion. You can file a motion with the court in person, by fax, by email, or mail. The court's website has more information for filing a motion. Go to the forums section for more information. If you pay off your balance in full, that is equivalent to pleading responsible to the charge, and the Arizona Motor Vehicle Division will be notified of this disposition. If you have further questions, you can find answers on our website at www.scottsdalez.gov courts. Also, you can contact the court by email at courts at scottsdalez.gov or call the court at 480-312-2442.